This is Orkun Muftogu, and I'm going to present you the implantation of the SY Trinova Trifocal Eyewall with CDT Seamless Vision Technology. These are the usual patterns of etchelets or steps used in other trifocal eyewall models. Note that the etchelets or steps are spiky but sharp edges in previous eyewall models. The new Acrobat Trinova Trifocal Eyewall comes with a unique innovation compared to other trifocal eyewall models. Instead of having sharp and spiky etchelet step design, the new eyewall has smoother step pattern that allows higher light transmission, balanced light distribution, and reduced scattered light and glare. Here we'll see the implantation of this eyewall. After capsular excess of 5 mm and hydrodissection, lens material is emulsified followed by injection of small amount of OVD in the back. Cartridge is filled with OVD and some OVD and DSS placed over the goose. The IOL is gently grasped with a tire forceps while pressing on the two edges of the holder. Then insert it in the cartridge. After making sure all the edges of the IOL are under the rim of the grooves of the cartridge, a tire forceps is used to gently press on the IOL through the two grooves of the cartridge. And simultaneously, the flaps of the cartridge are closed. A click sound should be heard to make sure the flaps are closed properly. Then the cartridge is inserted to the injector in a front-loading fashion. You can also add some more OVD from behind at this point. After the tip of the cartridge is placed into the wound, the plunger is pushed and the IOL is injected into the anterior chamber, sulcus or back in a slow and controlled fashion. Make sure the marking hole on the leading haptic is on your left hand side. Once the IOL is fully injected into the AC, you can just push down one end corner of the haptic to sneak it under the capsule, followed by the other ends. And you can push and slightly rotate while inserting the last one. Make sure to remove all OVD from the front and behind of the IOL. Centralization is usually perfect with this type of IOL, and you can close the wounds and finish the surgery. Note the smoother steps of the IOL and have a very good outcome the next day. Thanks.